My brothers and sisters, as we approach the 10th anniversary of 9-11, I want to take a moment, first of all, to encourage everyone in the Diocese of Harrisburg to pray for peace in the world as we commemorate this horrific event that took place in our country 10 years ago. We need the help of Almighty God to help all people of goodwill to make sure that something as horrific as what took place in New York on that day never happens again. At the same time, I do want to share with you a concern that I have. And it's more than a concern. It's a great disappointment. The disappointment that the mayor of New York, Mayor Bloomberg, has decided that no clergyman will be part of the program for the commemoration of the events of 9-11. In a country bounded upon Judeo-Christian principles, in a country that says we live under God. It is remarkable to me that a mayor could make such a decision, especially in light of what took place 10 years ago. On the day of 9-11, many people turned to God, asking for help and guidance. In the days that followed, many clergymen joined with the members of families who lost a loved one to pray with them and to pray for their loved ones who had died. It seems impossible to me that a country like the United States that expresses freedom of religion allows a mayor to prohibit a clergyman to be part of this important day. 9-11 will live on in infamy. It was a terrible day for all of us in the United States. I cannot believe that 10 years later, on a day that we needed to have Almighty God 10 years ago, the day we commemorated, we have no need of Almighty God, nor of prayers to the Supreme Being. I hope that all people of goodwill would make their feelings known. And I would hope that all Americans would see this as an outrage and that they would demand participation from their clergymen in this event in which we commemorate 9-11. Again, I ask everyone to continue to pray for the victims of 9-11, for their families who lost a loved one. Ten years seems a long time, but in the lives of those who lost a loved one, it seems like only yesterday. May God be with the families who commemorate this event, and may God bless America.